your book looks interesting. Your first one, uh, David Bell, The Dog Hunters, yeah. The Adventures of Llewellyn and Gellert, Book One. It's a uh, well, I won't go through the plot, although the plot looks fascinating. But it's it's basically for young adults. Yes, yes. Um, it's it, it's passed a little bit more towards lads than 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 girls. As I think girls are well served by by uh, teen literature at the moment. But this is this is a this is a it's a boys book. I mean, girls are like it because it's got dogs and it's got a bit of love going in. But yes, it's it's a boys book. It's it's about a it's about a boy and his dog. And to cut a long story short, there are lots of obvious plot machinations, but they are kidnapped and end up in China. Yep. Uh, it's it's huge. It's it's sprawling. It's a big mystery. Um, and as you say, I don't want to get too much away because that, that really is the plot. But it's uh, I'll just use the words medieval biological warfare and um, genetic engineering. It's, it's it's all feasible, though. It's not it's not a fantasy book. It's it's a sort of like a mystery. Yeah. It's it great. looks it looks like t- from the outside, without having read it, that the dog has special attributes. Um, <laughs> I don't want to give anything away. No, uh, no, you don't want to give it away. I mean, I'll withdraw the question. He, he farts a lot. <laughs> right, well, that's, that's a special, that's a special attribute. attribute. <laughs> yeah, uh, he's big. He's a very, very big dog. Um, he is legendary. He's done he's done one or two amazing things in his life. But uh, uh, again, I've got to stress, it's not a fantasy. It's 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 about as, as real as you can get. The, the, the dog is just a great dog, and, and wolfhounds... Um, as any wolfhound owner will tell you, are, are incredibly faithful. They're, they're legendarily faithful, and and the bond between the two boys is the is the real sort of like glue that holds everything together. Um, but they, they, special attributes, um, faithfulness, I think, is a special attribute. Yeah. All right, a medieval story about a boy and his Irish wolfhound who have fantastical adventures. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, the, the dog hunters. So. What's been the success? You're writing book two now, uh, so what's been the success story of the dog hunters so far? Well, I'm 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 pretty pleased to tell you the truth. It's uh, considering I haven't really done any publishing, uh, sorry, any marketing because it's self-published. It's 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 going down remarkably well. Funny enough, uh, particularly well with wolfhound uh, lovers, <laughs> um, which doesn't sound like there's many of them, but. I'm, I'm talking to people in the states and everything, and they measure in tens of thousands, and they're very, very um, keen to get it. I think yeah. the only problem I have is that at the moment it's just an e-book, and um, they all want to have um, paperbacks. So that's that's in the process at the moment, and wait for the first proofs to come through, and that's that's really exciting. I think, you know, because I'm getting on a bit, I'm 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 a little bit book centric myself, and and I I can't wait to. See smell the paper, so to speak. Yeah. I know, I can understand that. So this is what you want to do for the rest of your professional life, is write books. You know what? After all these years in advertising, and, and you know, it's, it, it's, a great, it's a great business for a creative person to work in because you, you, know, you meet all sorts of interesting people and you tell really interesting stories. But there are stories about other people's brands and you know, messages and everything like that. And, yeah. and since I've been actually writing for myself... It's just been fantastic. Uh, everyone should do it. It's great. It's the most wonderful, liberating adventure I've I've ever been through, apart from you know having kids. And, uh, I'm very pleased to hear that. As long as you can make a buck out of it, that's the thing. Uh, I, I don't expect to make much money. I think it'd be a bit silly to to expect that. Uh, it would be nice. Uh, I think this, the second one will make the first one work. If you know what I mean. It's, yeah. Yeah. It's oh. it's so exciting. So exciting. All right. The happy writer David Bell choosing yeah. the best song ever written.